So Mike, you've said it before, it doesn't matter if the market for buying a home is good or if it's bad. What's really important is making sure that your house is prepped to sell. Yeah, and it also doesn't matter whether it's a, a $200,000 home or a $2.5 million home. The reality is that you want to take the necessary time to prepare the house for the market. Beautiful brochures and you know uh, professional photography and videography and drones, that's all wonderful. But understand that uh, if I walk through a home today with a homeowner, they're going to share all the wonderful attributes of the home. They're gonna point out every little thing that they think is a selling point. The reality is that I and the seller are not present when the buyer walks through with a buyer's agent. And the buyer's agent is supposed to be an advocate for the buyer, so their job is to point out what's wrong with the home. So what I'm trying to do is get ahead of that and one, make sure that that, um, that uh, presentation is perfect, but also I'm removing objections. I'm getting things out of the way so that they can't come back to you later or try and factor that into the negotiations. So really it just helps avoid any kind of buyer's remorse post process. Absolutely, people will go under contract on a home and they'll spend the next 35 to 45 days second guessing the decision on whether this is the right home or not. What I wanna do is reinforce that decision because they keep going back to my marketing, they keep going back to the website, they keep visiting it, they share it with their friends and they go, look at my new home, look at the house I'm moving into. I wanna keep them in and interested and deliver the right product to them.